<coughs> okay, we have an ASA six pin uh, challenge lock number five. Uh, it is locked up. This is the key for the lock. Okay, it works very smooth. This is the bidding on the key. And as I said, we are locked. Let's uh, use top of the keyway. And let's go to the back. Let's find a pin six. Felt like we might have got just a little false set out of pin six. I barely felt it. Okay, a little bit out of pin three. Okay, pin one. Go back and catch pin two. Pin two giving us a little bit of a feedback. Drop pin two. Okay. There's pin six. Okay, pin three again. Okay, got a little more of a false set out of pin two then. Moved quite a bit. Okay, a little bit more out of pin three. A little feedback on pin uh, five, I believe. Not wanting to set. See, check the other pins. Make sure that is the right pin. That my pick's not hitting the wrong pin. Okay, we lost our false set. See if we can get it back. Okay, there it is open. Okay, let's um, see what kind of pins are in this lock. Okay, let's lock it back up. We do have the key, so this uh, so we can get these screws out.
Okay, all pins are in. Number one pin is a serrated pin. Number two is serrated, heavily serrated. Number one is serrated, I mean number three. Number four is serrated. Number five is also serrated. Number six is serrated. Let's look at the, um, okay, every, um, Looks like there is um, counter milling in uh, every one, or maybe that's just a natural. Let me put that down and make it a light. They don't have a light handy so um, it does have uh, some ledges in it to catch the pins on okay let's check the uh, top pins Okay, pin number one, come out just like this. Let me check, they look like there's a wafer in there too. Yeah, there is a wafer. Okay, some type of T-pin there. Okay, number two, come out just like this and also another wafer there's a spring okay there's a wafer come out pin number three come out just like this Okay, pin number four, just like this. Okay. Okay, pin number five. You can see it there. Uh, looks like there's a wafer underneath it also. So, uh, let's see if we can get those. Okay, there's the pin and the wafer okay now number six okay it's uh, come out just like this and there's nothing um, weird about the um, Bible Okay, let's see if we can get a closer look at the pins. Let's look at uh, these two. All right, this had a uh, serrated uh, key pin, also a uh, serrated type of uh, T pin with a wafer on top. Number two had uh, three uh, serrations on top of the key pin and another um, T pin with a wafer. Okay, number uh, three and four. Let's see if we can get a little closer look. 
Okay, number three and four was a uh, serrated uh, key pin and looked like a serrated spool. Uh, this one was a serrated uh, key pin, had double serrations on it. This is another uh, type of uh, serrated spool, even though it come out just like this. Okay, now number five and six. Okay, five and six, uh, on number five, there was a serrated uh, key pin. There was a wafer on top of this uh, weird type of uh, T-pin. It's got uh, like a spool T-pin here with this wafer on top of it. And this is another weird... Um, type of spool cut way down to where this would catch on the uh, ledge of the lock and this is a um, key pin serrated okay that's what we have in this ASA lock challenge lock number five okay I appreciate your time please do not do anything illegal Please stay out of trouble, and thank you again.